We are back to the YouTube channel. It's a video. It's a video. Why are you putting your face like? Yeah, so if you don't know, today is my bail day. Yeah. Yeah. Where's my bookie's face? My, for information, my big head has covered my bookie's face. That's why. But yeah, we are on our way to. Maybe in the delivery world. Oh. KFC. Uh, I have a question. I am an MC. Yeah, uh, mm. That's not okay. Mm. Can you see? Mm. Yes. I ah, can you see? Can you I see? Come from uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> we are driving, but we won't reach PC. Oh, see. see what this is out. <laughs> it's very good. Please feed your children with a lot of secular food. <laughs> yes, because they when you healthy, they will grow secular and round. Wow. So say you teach your if you feed your child with song like um, "Would you wine for me, wine for me"? Then it's very very good. Because your child will learn very early yeah. Yeah. how to wine for people if she's the lady yeah. or how to receive wine is mm. if she's a, if he's a guy mm. and you start to believe that maybe the purpose, purpose of life. women is for them to wine, wine. And, and that's dying. a very very good aspect in life because mm. women are only meant and to, to wine. wine their bodies but yeah. objectification See, of women wait. and sexualizing of them Boosting toxic masculinity hey, information <laughs> do better sis yeah do I'm going to add like SHS to the when they finish this, they go to the mall. They'll be taking pictures and videos. Ah, my bomb is nice. that you check the information you feed them with at a young age make sure that not censoring and protecting them from what they should do but teaching them what is right and what they should what they should be on so it's very important Asda, what is KFC's motivation to put the meat in this particular coating? They have modified it. They are selling it to the rest of the world because y'all don't know any better. <laughs> 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 I think it's like nutrients. If you want your child to grow well and you want your child to flourish and become big, you feed your child with good food that contains good nutrients. So if you feed your child with junk food, here in the case being secular music. They you know that your child is going to be deformed in certain areas or be deficient in certain in real like, life. nutrients and lack something. So it's just like nutrients. You understand? And with no parent would like to feed his or her child with food that would actually cause deformities in their child or deficiencies in their child or cause the child to get sick. So as music. So if you decide to feed your child with songs that contain no nutrients and even songs that contain poisonous nutrients then you know that your child is not going to grow as you want the child to grow every parent's desire is to see their child become a grown nourished person and being so yes that's also another reason why you should feed your children with good music and in the case christian music So this is the Monaco Picasso uh -huh. sleeper. Uh -huh. Trust me, they just put the name there to make it sound fancy. That's the name. Monaco, Monaco Picasso, Picasso sleeper. Yes, Mumbo. The reason why, right now, right now, we sell a lot of children. You are saying that Omar say Omar say is because of 
because we didn't check this because people don't know that whatever information they are taking into their system are seeds so when sometimes when we see children doing something we are shocked no although he didn't teach them he learned it in in another place yes because i mean the musicians just get away with whatever they say mm -hmm. and now like as time i mean when i was even younger they used to even um, censor some of the words but now everything is wow. even just out there and the kids learn it i mean you see a video of a small child telling his mother <laughs> <You're> like, <laughs> it's the way I just said it for me. Okay, it's not that the child would never hear those words. Of course they would, but those songs normalize it or make it seem like it's not a big deal. Because I mean, they have they make role models of the musicians, and if those musicians are using those they words, look up to them. and they look up to them, like oh my god, my favorite rapper always says this, then I can also say it because it will make me more like him. But they really want to be like those people. They're like their heroes. Yes, yeah, so you, you get a chance as a parent to choose who becomes their hero, at least in some way to influence. Of course, you cannot direct it completely. I know people whose parents ban secular music, but they are like the yeah. bosses of it now. Yeah. But at least you get a chance to at least, wow. at least God knows you tried. I mean, you had the opportunity to to shepherd your kids. I mean, and then you, and you, you made the most of it while you could. And you pray for them that hopefully whatever you teach them will stay with them. Parents don't necessarily teach children some values, but then they don't ban secular music. So they, their children learn from secular music and then the parents are alarmed when they find out that the children are exhibiting such values. I hope you get what I'm saying. But you've not really taught your child about having or, I mean, sexual morality, all, but then he has learned it or he or she has learned it from them. But then you, are, you as a parent in there, they like, on train or that, but I could see So when they finally get to know that, a queer say, put your body on me. That's how, that's how come my mother was crying that. Bishop, Bishop, Bishop. 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 Inside. I also feel like some parents also neglect some aspects of their children. They just take care of them, education, they make sure they are going to better school. As for the rest of the life, they oh, we should go oh, take care of the other things. I'm excited. I'm excited. <laughs> I'm super, I'm excited. <laughs>